you stop, please? Can you stop? I'm going to make a statement. You don't. Um, the British people have made immense sacrifices in the ongoing battle against COVID-19. I now fear that my comments in the leaked video of the 20th of December last year have become a distraction in that fight. My remarks seemed to make light of the rules. Rules that people were doing everything to obey. That was never my intention. I will regret those remarks for the rest of my days and I offer my profound apologies to all of you at home for them. Working in government is an immense privilege. I tried to do right by you all, to behave with civility and decency and act to the high standards you expect of number 10, rightly expect of number 10. I will always be proud of what was achieved at COP26 in Glasgow and the progress that was made on coal cars, cash and trees. This country and the Prime Minister's leadership on climate change and on nature will make a lasting difference to the whole world. It has been an honour to play a part in that. I understand the anger and frustration that people feel. To all of you who lost loved ones, who endured intolerable loneliness and who struggled with your businesses, I am truly sorry and this afternoon I... I'm offering my resignation to the Prime Minister. Thanks for your time.